What up, what up, what up, what up? Happy payday, you suckers. Happy Friday, you suckers. It's your boy. <laughs> so, a while back, I had put this post up. And uh, it was actually from someone else. I think it was from my homegirl, Millie. And got a lot of responses off of it. I seen it on her post, copied it, put it on my um, page, and then got this response. So let's go ahead and let me show you all this. Let me check this out. So I got quite a few shares out of this. This is one person who shared it. Here's another person who shared it. And then it just got wacky from that point on. Check it out. I don't know what you're doing if you're 40 years old and you don't have grandkids. I don't know what the hell you're doing. I see people on there that was 47, 49, 45. What are you doing with your life? When do you plan on being a grandparent? You know what I'm saying? Like, I think my grand, I, I, as a matter of fact, my grandparents were in their 40s. When I recognized that they were my grandparents. You know what I'm saying, baby? What are you doing with your life? If you're 40 years old and you don't have grandkids, man. Right? You know what I'm saying? Like, you don't have to exactly be 40. But be in your 40s. How do you reach 45, 47, 49 and you don't have no grandkids? That's all I'm saying, baby. That's all I'm saying. Hey. I ain't trying to force procreation. I'm not trying to force creation. I'm not trying to increase the population. All I'm saying is, what are you doing with your life? If you're 40 or in your 40s, and you have no grandkids. That's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. Now we're gonna get into a segment that it's been a while. It's been a while. Let's get let's get right on into it. All right, all right, all right. We're going to get in the third eye poke where I say three. That's right, three statements that a poke is straight in, in a, the third eye. Let us begin. If we successfully colonize Mars, then Earth will have its first true competitor for Miss Universe. If your friends tell you not to give in to peer pressure and you don't, technically, you did. Burning books deletes information while burning CDs duplicates information. Hmm. I think it's time for you to come up with a question. It's the question. 
All right. Question. If you were starving and a pregnant woman came up to you and asked you for some of your food, would you give her some of your food? Now, why am I asking a question such as thus? Because there was a long time ago, a long time ago, I was living in California and I was taking the bus to work. Bus number one out of three. And this pregnant Mexican woman came up to me. I was grubbing, I was eating something. She came up to me and she was signaling that she wanted some of my food. And I, I kind of bugged out on that because I'm thinking, why would somebody walk up to somebody that they don't know and ask them for some of their food. Now let's 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 be clear. It was something like chips or some fries, something that I could break off, and and this person's eating would not affect mine. Okay. Well, I'm sitting there and eating a bag of chips or whatever, waiting to go to work. She walks up and she's like, "Yeah, yeah." Literally, she was doing that. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I noticed that she was pregnant. So did I give her some of my food? Well, you answer the question first and I'll answer the question. What would you do if a pregnant woman came up to you and you were eating and you were starving and she came up and asked you for your food? Would you share or would you not share? Let me know below. Let me know below. I think I'm going to cut the show a little bit short here so I can get it out for Friday. Y'all have a good one. Happy Friday to you. Happy payday, you suckers. Cookie's in the house. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. And don't forget to like, comment, share. Later. <laughs> That man is his own worst enemy. Under me, this rule will change, for I will restrain man. <laughs>